Hi guys, it's Allie. I wanted to make a video today to share something that's pretty exciting. Um, we're gonna be paying off our house very soon. Um, this has been a journey for a little while. We haven't always been able to focus on our house. We've had a lot of other debt that we've had to work our way through, student loans to the tune of $95,000. We had car payments. Um, just a bunch of different things, but over the last two years, we've been able to really focus on paying off the house, uh, and I wanna show you what that looks like for us. So I'm doing a screen share here, so you can see the current balance on our house is $4,700. Uh, our home originally cost us $207,000. That's what we financed. We financed it at 3%. 3.6% 30-year fixed mortgage and um, I'll just show you what that looks like uh, we bought the house in September 2012 which admittedly was a good time to buy a house uh, our loan is supposed to terminate in October of 2042 but we're gonna knock a few years off that uh, well I've actually, I actually haven't done the math so we we got the house in 12 we're going to be paying it off in 21, so nine years, uh, paying off a 30-year mortgage in nine years. You can see the amount that we are prepaid on our mortgage, and like this looks like a crazy amount. Like who prepays their mortgage? $163,000 didn't happen overnight. Um, I can tell you how it happened. Um, anytime. Well, for one thing, let me start with, we live on less than we, we make, um, and I, I'm blessed to have a decent income. Rebecca has a fair income. Together, um, we, you know, we live on less than we make. We don't drive brand new cars. We don't go on crazy shopping trips or really elaborate vacations. Um, we do things that are important to us and spend money where it matters to us. Um, good food is one area where we, we definitely spend um, money and we prioritize. Apparently raising chickens is also an area where we like to spend money. <laughs> Not my hobby, <laughs> obviously. Uh, so back to this. So uh, it mon months looked like this. The mortgage payment is $1,300 and I would tack on another 4000 or another 5000 Whatever I could safely add as a principal payment, I would do that. Um, and so, you know, here we are. Um, we're prepaid ahead by all that. We've got this remaining, um, which I could just do in one payment. They have a nice little tool on this website to see your payoff amount, which actually came in at 4,600. I think it's something about interest. You save a little bit on that. So 4,600, I can pay off the house. I do have escrow, which you can see here. Um, currently the escrow account has $2,600 in it. That will get refunded to me when the house is paid off. Uh, I'm not off the hook though. I do need that money. We've got taxes coming up September 2021. Got insurance coming up September 17th. So, and that's 580, you know, a little under $3,000. So when this money comes back, I will just set it aside for when my tax bill comes and I will mail them a check for taxes. Um, I'm trying to think what else I can say. It's just exciting. It feels kind of surreal to not have a mortgage payment soon, not to have debt. Um, you know, it, we don't have plans on selling the house, but the house is definitely appreciated. I told you we get the original loan amount for about $207,000 and the estimated value of the house is about three fifty. dollars um, So definitely home ownership can be a good thing when you're buying at a good time and letting the house appreciate. Uh, might be a little different if you're buying high. Um, but basically, I just wanted to show you what focus can, where you can go with focus. Um, you know, we're now able to take that monthly payment, which is right here. That's the monthly payment um, if I was to not include anything extra. Uh, and now that 1360 can go to whatever we want it to go to. It can go to a vacation fund, it can go towards solar panels for the house or an electric vehicle for me. <laughs> Not to hint at future goals. Um, definitely a vacation is um, gonna be in the plans because Rebecca has endured me um, 
really focusing on this and you know to her credit has contributed quite a bit especially over this last uh stretch of paying off the house she's really helped with that so yeah guys that's that's it i just wanted to share that um that's what i've been up to um so soon to be debt free and i guess we'll see where i can go from there bye guys